Tell a friend and tell a friend. Now do it on Hollers in. And we're back with another NBA 2K24 Next Gen Build video. And today I have a Kristoff Pazinga build for you guys, man. This build right here can be a really fun build depending on who controlling the build. You have post scoring on this build, standing dunk. You will be able to shoot the lights out. You can pass good with this build and you can play defense. So make sure you guys watch the video to the end so I can show you this masterpiece. Choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before I go any further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know. It's like button time and I need you guys to go down and hit the like button. Get this video to 100 likes. And if you haven't already, hit the link in the description to join the Discord. Hit the link in the description to follow me on Twitch. So with this build, as you can see, we're going to the center position. 7-1, I think he's 7-2 in real life. 7-1, 7-2, somewhere around there. 246 pounds on the weight, 72 wings, man. Let's get into it. So, we're going to go ahead and start with the finishing on this build. And um, Pazingas is a really good player, man. I think he would have, they would have swept the Mavericks if he would have been playing like he like he can. You know what I'm saying? If he was 100% healthy. Because he is a, a problem on the perimeter. That was something the Timberwolves didn't have. They got Rudy Gobert. He's a clogger. He's a paint clogger. But Pazingas is going to pull the opposing center out of the paint so you know what i'm saying I, that's what i love about the singers but anyway post control we do have that at 85 that does give us gold drop step or gold post spin uh, we also have the standard dunk at 85 that does give us silver fast twitch and silver rise up so that's pretty good and we do get the big man contact dunk we don't get elite but we do get some pro big man contact dunk which is good for the driver dunk we did take that to a 75 and we're going to leave the layup where it went to uh we're going to get that close shot up a little bit higher since this is the center um, we're going to take that to a 71. Now, you don't have to do the close shot high like that. If you don't want to, you can go with the layup. Um, but you're still going to get fearless finisher with the uh, close shot. And you will get master. So that's why I did what I did with that. But overall, for the finishing, I think it's really, really good. You do get posterized on this build. Uh, I'm going to show you that in a second. You also get slithery. Then you get spin cycle on goal. So we're going to come down to the physicals. Get that speed up. You 7-1. Keep that in mind. Acceleration. We got that at a 50. Which, you know, it ain't too much but you know it's something for the strength we're going to do a 90 for the vert we're just going to do a 75 um, that's all you really need um, and don't go to an 80 anyway and then you don't get gold chase down orders because you're 7 1 so we're not worried about that but we're going to come back up to the finishing as you can see we get dream shake on silver hook specialist silver unpluckable silver back down punish on gold so that's pretty good we also get post phase feed numb too you know what i'm saying so we can do some post phase if we want to but let's go ahead and get it to the green bee make your girl scream badge this bill does have um some three-point shooting and, and a lot of three-point shooting at that we have that at 85 we want to focus more on that because pazingas can shoot threes really good um to be that tall he can shoot really good okay free throw we're going to take that to a 71 the 85 um um three does give us catch and shoot on goal clay more corner specials all three of those bads are on goal and that's really good in my opinion we got silver dead out silver uh blinders we can't get agent three uh silver green machine and we also have bronze limitless range so this bill will be able to shoot from deep okay that's the fun part about this bill me personally i had a 7-1 bill <clears throat> excuse me i had a 7-1 bill at the beginning of the year but that bill was just too slow for me i'm talking about doo-doo man i'm talking about constipated slow you know what i'm saying and i just couldn't get used to that i even tried a seven foot center you know what i'm saying i tried a seven foot center then I end up going down to 6'10", then I end up going to 6'8", and then I went to 6'7". So I have had a center at a lot of heights, man, you know, and I don't think I like the tall centers anymore, but, you know, that's just me and the way I play. I like to be a kind of a, a smaller build that can move around a little bit faster than the other players, so I would rather have that. But we do get some good shooting on this build. Um, you will be able to make hella shots, okay? But let's go ahead and get into the sauce. But before we do... I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody, mama, can see this video. And I need everybody, mama, to see the video. So do that for your boy, boy. Pass accuracy, we're going to get that to a 77. That does allow us to get needle thread on bronze, as you can see. We got touch pass on bronze. We got um, silver dimer, silver brace starter, post playmaker, relay pass, or special delivery. So, yes. You do have some great passing on this build to be a center. You can pass in the half court. You can get the rebound to kick the ball up the court and start the fast break. You can dribble a little bit with this build, which I will show you right now. Uh, we're going to take that ball handle up to what we need. Like, we could take it higher, but we're just going to take it to a 62. And the speed with ball is just going to get that to a 48. That's all we need to get big driver. We got big driver right there. As you can see, we can't get it on goal because we need 
a 65 ball handle and a 55 speed with ball and we can't get our speed with ball and the acceleration up that high anyway so it don't even matter but um, we do have break start and that's uh, that's what's most important to me um, when you're playing the center position so when you get the rebound you can just kick the ball up the court with no problem you know and start the fast break get you some easy assists or whatnot and that should be here she that should help your team okay let's get into the defense so with the defense on this build we want to make sure that we can man the paint. You know, you want to be able to alter shots. You want to be able to block shots. You're tall as hell, and you want to be able to do that. So we're going to take the interior defense to an 82. That does give us post lockdown on silver, as you can see. Um, that does help us out in the paint. As far as the block, we're going to take that to an 87. I think that's good enough. But the only thing about six, I mean seven one, is that you don't get chase down artists on gold, which I still think you can block shots with it on silver. But it would be nice to get it on gold. But we do have anchor. And we will get Pogo on goal as well. As far as the perimeter defense, we are going to get that up to a 58. And that does give us all ball pass. I know a lot of people probably want that. And that's really the only badge you can get. Um, of course, we're going to get workhorse. Uh, no steal on the bill. You can take it up if you want to. You can get it to a 60, but we're not worried about that. Okay. Um, like I said, block 87. Uh, for the rebound, we're going to do offensive rebound number 93. And we're going to do a 80 on the defense. Now, you can switch, uh, flip these around if you want to. A lot of people would go uh, 93 defense rebound and then like 70 on the offense, which is fine. You know what I'm saying? Since you tall like this. But, um, you know, I'd rather just have the offensive rebound for them second chance points. Uh, we do get Hall of Fame box. Uh, we do get gold, pogo, gold, gold rebound taste. So, yes, you will be able to get some rebounds with this build. You will be able to hold your box out because you have a 90 strength with the Hall of Fame box. So, I think that's pretty good. Now, as far as the physical, we got a 60 speed. 50 acceleration, 90 on the strength. As you can see, we got some good badges with that strength. Gold and mover, uh, gold brick wall, uh, 75 on the vert, and the rest is on stamina. Now, let's get into these shades up. Are you ready? Because guess what? I do not click back. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Now, we do have shades of Christoph Zingas, Sabonis, and Joey LB. Man, I like that, um, that, 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 those comparisons right there, man. Glass cleaning, three point threat. You got all three of those dudes. They tall. They can pass. They can shoot. All three of them. You know what I'm saying? Like that. That's that's one of the best comparisons I've seen. Sabonis can pass a little bit better than both of those guys, but B he's a monster in the post. Przingis he can shoot the threes good, and B can shoot the mid range good. So uh, you know, it, it's kind of low, but man, overall good build in my opinion, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comments, and I'm out of here like last year. Charge.